yeah good morning everybody um good afternoon good evening depending on wherever you're watching me across the globe my name is emeka godwin Omenico, of women called lifestyle channel apparently so i want to welcome you again for my old cost um subscribers i want to um thank you for being there and the new subscribers that are seeing this for the first time well today i want to be teaching you guys how to cultivate beans how to plant beans you know in your home garden or you have a small piece of land that you're not using on this land that you can see right just behind me this vast expanse of land you can see i cultivated these beans you just saw on my hands these beans was grown here um there are various stages in planting beans and it is not that difficult the first thing is to actually locate the space where you want to farm the beans and if it's a large piece of land like i have here the first thing you do is to um make your ridges when you make your ridges then you um normally what i like to do i spray chemicals that kill every any every and any form of um weed or um, grass that may grow on the land then i also plant on that same day why do i do this i do this because i don't want when the um, bean starts sprouting it starts competing with the grass but once when i spray that chemical it takes like three two days for the chemical to sink into the ground and start destroying whatever is there it will take the grass maybe another one month or one and a half months to two months depending on the kind of chemical you put to start growing at this point in time you are already near the harvesting of the beans mm -hmm. so this is the um herbicide i use i either use this or there's another brand i used i always use so when you use this it kills off the grass you know and all that so your your beans have um what they call um nutrients enough for it to grow it this is what i use well done no. After planting the beans, it takes about um, one month or, or one and a half months for the beans to, to start flowering. When, when it starts flowering, I spray insecticides. This insecticide and pesticides. It drives off all the pests and insects that comes around to start eating the beans leaves and, uh, and this uh, inhibits the growth and production of your beans seed. It either makes the beans seed small or they don't have, uh, you don't have a good production of beans. So I spray pesticides and insecticides so it doesn't um, um, affect the beans. So I'm oh. This is the chemical I used for the beans to um, the pesticide I used um, to actually um, uh, weed, uh, kill pests and insects. You can see this is a grasshopper and this is a moth. So this they feed on the leaf of the beans and other garden plants you have. So you this is what I used. You can see there is beans here also. They also going to feast on the beans. So this is what I used. I, I, I you can spray this once the beans, uh, the flower has come out and the beans uh, have started. It has started producing the beans, so that um, once you when, when you spray all this, it starts killing off. It drives this insect away. Sometimes you can apply it once a week or um, twice. I mean, once in two weeks. So the second month, uh, grasses are already coming out on the soil, from the soil. So at that point, I now also weed um, the beans. Depending on the situation around where you are farming. So, 
uh, we're going to I'm going to go right ahead into the uh, what, what I did and what I got as harvest. So kindly make sure you watch to the end of the video so that you can understand what I'm talking about. You're going to see how I actually farmed the beans, how I actually harvest um, cultivated, weeded the farm, and also harvested the beans. So join me as I show you all that went through in 2021 so 2022 should be a motivation for you i think you should go out there and farm do these things it's not difficult it will save you a lot of um cost on feeding your family uh, and um probably friends as well and also you get the opportunity to see my harvest this was part of my harvest last year 2021 which i've preserved you can see i have pepper in here which I've preserved for this 2022 farming season, which is around the corner. We're in February already, and you know, anytime from March, April ending, um, where the farming season will be upon us, I will start farming. So you go out there and fat, uh, prop, uh, farm, till your land, plant your crops, grow your crops, and feed your family, and save yourself a lot of expenses in um, a lot of expenses in terms of food purchase. Thank you. Kindly watch this video to the end and see how the process was being done in 2021. Thank you very much. Because my only that place I found beans last year. Mm. Did you hear me? Mm. My only that place I found beans last year. And the people go, they look at they come and take one out of the farm. So this is harvesting season. They will run or they will not agree. Some are very ready, some are not. So, this is just from like three lines, three ridges, very short ridges, and not even all. Like, this is fucking crazy. So, if you can understand the relation between this and this, then you're a genius. Hello. <laughs> we are processing beans. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Come on, it's not easy. This is this is how we are processing the beans. I'm telling you. You <laughs> know when you're looking like that. But I just gave away now. I can take it back. I don't wanna get lost. Oh, I don't want to live a life without you. Hey, I have the, this thing now. Hey. Yeah, I have uh -huh. the So, like I said earlier, these are some of the harvest I had. I had about seven of these 10 liter um, containers, rubber, that I harvested. And I had quite a number of these also. But, you know, I gave them to family and friends. So, I just have, the, we've been feeding on these beans since harvest, which is around November last year, till now. What I planted was just this. Um, two, I mean, was it two or three? Three of these, three. That's two mudu, uh, two of these makes one, right? Mm -hmm. One and a half. And um, so this, so uh, what we call mudu is something like this. This is the measurement of what I planted, just one and a half of this to give me all this harvest. And each of these drum contains seven of these. Each of these drum contains seven of these but what i planted was one and a half you can see how farming is a very interesting um thing to to actually practice if you liked what you saw or you know somebody that would like kindly help me to like this video you can comment what you want me to post more on on under the comment section down below then also if you haven't subscribed please kindly uh, click the subscribe button then also share the video so that people can see and i'll be motivated actually to out 
put up more videos on my lifestyle, how I live, how I farm, how I go about things that can also help other people achieve um, good and similar results in their own life. So can you help me share this video? Like, comment, subscribe, subscribe. Also refer your friends and family members to subscribe. And who is gonna take your place? My place, ba? Yes. I should have seen it coming. I should have read the signs. Anyway, anyway, I guess it's over. I can't believe that I'm the fool again. I thought this love would never end. How was I to know? You never told me. Can't believe that I'm the fool again. And now you know, <laughs> you know, my friend. How was I to know? You never told me. Come on.